Hello guys, welcome back to my YouTube channel. This is Session, and you are watching Ira's World YouTube channel. So guys, today I am going to show you the very interesting topic that how you can convert your iPhone 6, 6s, iPhone 5s, iPhone 7, 8, 8 Plus into iPhone X. Same working like iPhone X. Okay guys, so I hope you will like this video. So firstly guys you need to watch this video till very end if you skip any part of the video you will not be able to make your iPhone look like same as iPhone X in the screen recording or in the same functioning. So let's start let's proceed to the video firstly guys you can see here this is my iPhone X model and this is currently running on iOS 13.7 not 14 you can see this is the iPhone X and this is on 13.7 and this is the iPhone 6 only not 6s not 7 this is only 6 which is currently running on iOS 12.4.8 so I hope uh, you uh, will like this video so let's start firstly guys in this method firstly I want to show you that you need jailbroken device if you don't know how to jailbreak your iPhone in a single clicks guys firstly that from iPhone 5s to iPhone X only these devices are supported in this list any device can be jailbreak okay guys so how you can jailbreak the first link will be available in description box you can just go and watch the video that how you can jailbreak your iphone simple steps with windows or in mac os without computer it's right now it's not possible okay guys so how you can jailbreak ios 14 is also supported so you can see here this is my iphone 6 and let me show you the ios version of my iphone you can see the in the about section ios version is 12.4.8 and model name is iphone 6 so firstly guys in iphone x you usually use your gestures there's no any physical home button in iphone x so you using gestures if you want to get control center you will get control center from the top right hand side of the corner will you swipe up to from up to bottom you will get the control center okay guys so this is the main uh, the second one is the for, for going in the home screen if you want to go in home screen you can see just you can swipe down from upside and it will go, go for home screen as you can see it just going in home screen usually you do like this one okay guys so if you want to go in app store sorry guys in app switcher or in recent apps you need to just normally swipe up and hold for a second and it will show and release and it will show recent apps and you can clear all the recent apps and the third one the main thing is that this is the bottom bar in any application so how you can also get this in your iPhone 6 6s 7 7 plus 8 plus any iPhone okay guys which is having physical home button so as guys you can see here this is having rounded assistive touch icon so how you can get these tips or tricks in your or tweaks in your iphone which is having physical home button so as you can see here i have same do like same I, iphone x you can see rounded assist touch control center from the top right hand side of the corner going back and the bottom bar also in the screenshots also i in a single same manner i am using iphone 6 same like iphone x model so how you can uh, firstly let me show you the assisted touch in the uh, normal physical home button you can see this is square icon and this is the rounded icon you can see this is the rounded icon this is the square icon and you are on normally using your uh, home button to get these all the functioning in case your home button is broken also you can also use these gestures you can see in iphone 6 for the control center you can see top right hand side of the corner just swipe bottom to bottom from up to bottom and you will get the control center same like iPhone X and for go back in home screen you can see just swipe up and your apps will just go back without any lag or without any hang problem this is same fluid as fluid as iPhone X original okay guys so for the recent apps you need to just swipe up and hold for a second and release this and you will get all the recent apps it's same like iPhone X and for the notification you need to just swipe down from any of the portion of your screen okay guys just you need to for control center top right hand side of the screen so you can see this is the same like iPhone X so how you can get the, uh, the assistive touches same like iPhone X so how you can get in this your iPhone firstly jailbreak your iPhone after jailbreaking if you don't know the link will be available just go and watch the video how you can jailbreak your iPhone for jail, uh, after jailbreaking open Cydia and just hold on guys and you can see let me show you the tweaks I'm using you can see the first one is assistive touch X for the rounded assistive touch icon for this you need to install this one if it doesn't find any of the uh, tweak then I will give also the repo will be given you can see this is from the uh, uh, repo tweaks 
uh, normally it will be available for you assisted touch x and for the swiping gestures what i need to do i need to install neptune for iphone so guys if you are on ios 12 then you need to install neptune for iphone if you are on ios 13 or 14 then you need to install little 11 okay guys these are the tweaks which doesn't crash anymore so you can see neptune for iphone you can see here the same like uh, iphone x gestures this is from big boss tweak big boss repo okay guys and the third one i'm using is the uh, for the dark mode and the third one is for example uh, the fourth number is the widgets ios 14 widgets uh, you need to install hs widgets as you can see hs widgets so and the last one is the uh, i have to say dark mode dark mode you can see i have applied dark mode in my control center and you can see all the dark mode is applied and it is true dark mode it is not anymore any of the theme for the this dark mode let me disable dark mode for this dark mode you need to install noctis 12 Noctis 12. So these are the tweaks. I will give the repo link and the tweak name in the description. Just check the description also. So I hope you like this video. So thank you guys. Thanks for watching. I will see you in the next one.